Buenos dias amigos, it's your man Constant, and tonight we have a special invite. That's right, I am here with none other than Jason Belmonte, and we are at the Chris Paul Charity Bowling event. Now, Chris Paul's a beast in the lanes, in case you haven't heard, and his friends are pretty good too, so let's go inside and check them out and see what they got. All right, guys, I am chilling here with the man, the myth, the legend, none other than Chris Paul. I'm a CP3 fan. I wear it back in the day. Some of your pregame meals used to be like sushi or whatever. You just rolled in, eat whatever, and just killed them. Have you changed it up a little bit or what? It wasn't sushi. It wasn't sushi. When I was in New Orleans, everything was fried. Everything. Uh, so now it's a lot different. You know, I didn't even know what gluten-free was until I moved <laughs> out here to the West Coast. But my wife's pregnant, as I told you earlier. I'm having my first child. Can, yeah. can you say hi to Sarah for me? Sarah, uh, congratulations um, on your beautiful baby girl. I hope everything goes well. And uh, Chris, Christina sounds good to me, something like that. <laughs> Okay, you gotta be nice to the charity, it's a charity. But you gotta bring the ruckus a little bit too, and I'll see you ready to bring it. Absolutely, man. You know what? Listen, I'm not gonna step on a basketball court with these guys, but if they wanna step onto a bowling lane with me, I gotta show them what time it is, man. Step in the kitchen, they're getting cooked. Absolutely. All right, y'all, don't panic. The man, French Montana. What's up, homie? What's up, what's up, man? You know, just here, just trying to bowl. I know you a hell of a rapper, son, but bowling, I did not, play French Montana at the bowling lanes. How long you been into it? Yeah, I'm really not good at it. Okay, good. Me neither. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm really not good at it. Man, I'm, 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 I'm going to try my hardest tonight. I heard they got professionals here. All right, Whistle fans, it just got real serious up in here. We got Pete Weber. How are you, sir? I'm doing great, man. This is one of the best nights of the year for us. You know what, man? When you were coming over here, I get the sense like you're the real deal, man. You look like you got a, a game face. What's you? Do you have one? What is it? Man, you gotta you gotta get the, the scowl in there, and you gotta look at people like that's the way it's gonna be. I'm the winner. All right, guys. I am chilling with Chris Hardwick. Is it midnight? You got that? You get that? It's not. I I, I vaguely understand that reference. <laughs> Am I supposed to give you points for that? No, nah, man, it's not that good. Okay, okay, okay. okay. No points, no points. Yeah, but I'm going to give you points because I've been talking to a lot of the pro bowlers, and your name has come up as a, a lot as a guy they'd love to be paired with. What's up with that? Um, well, you know, my dad was a professional bowler. I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe there's a little bit of bowling legacy involved. But I'm not, I am not the bowler my father. I'm good, I'm good. But I'm not amazing. Says the guy who won it last year. Well, I was, I was born basically in a bowling center. My parents built a bowling center a couple of days, a couple of weeks after I was born. Um, so I grew up in one and all the bowling balls we had were 10 pounds. So I started bowling when I was 18 months old. So the lightest ball was 10 pounds, the heaviest was 16, but as a little 18 month old right. baby boy, I wasn't gonna swing that ball with one hand. So I kind of did the old baby push. And as I was getting a little bit older, I still couldn't use one hand. So I put my fingers in and use this two-handed delivery and then I saw the ball curve more than everyone else in town and I was sold. All right, folks, so there you have it. My man, Chris Paul, did not disappoint. What a great night it was. Yo, some of the people out here, y'all could check into a Sunday league or something. Yeah, I got skills. Anyway, folks, we want to know what you think about this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and leave some comments under there. And we will see you on the next Whistle video. I'm out of here.